Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks. And today I'm going to show you how to get a dark material design theme on your Nexus 5. You'll need to be rooted with a custom recovery installed for this one. And the zip we're using here was made for the Nexus 5. So it's not intended for use with any other phone. But if you don't have a custom recovery installed on your Nexus 5 and you'd still like to try this out, you should check out the full tutorial to link in the description below. I've got guides over there that'll help you get all the requirements knocked out. So yeah, be sure to check it out. So this mod comes courtesy of developer Vivek Neal, and he's done some really nice work here. The theme keeps Lollipop's new material design language intact, but it darkens some of the brighter menus and apps. There are actually four different zips that you can use here. Each one themes a different app or UI element. There's one for the system UI, one for the dialer, contacts, and even the Google Now launcher. So you can pick and choose which elements you'd like to theme, or you can install them all to get this dark theme on almost all core apps. These zips are all linked out at the full tutorial, so head over there to download whichever ones you want to use. Then when the files are all saved to your device, you'll just need to boot into custom recovery. To do that, start by powering your phone completely off. When the screen goes black, press and hold the volume down and power buttons simultaneously. This will bring up Android's bootloader menu, and from here just press the volume down button twice to highlight recovery mode, then press the power button to select it. Now before you flash anything in custom recovery, it's always a good idea to make a full backup. There are revert zips available for this mod, but the easiest way to undo this theme would be to restore a fresh backup. So yeah, make sure you take care of that first, then go ahead and tap the install button here. After that, navigate to your phone's download folder to find the zip files you grabbed from the tutorial. Really, you can start with whichever one you want. And if you're just installing one, all you have to do is select it, then swipe the slider at the bottom of the screen to install it. But if you're installing more than one, tap this Add More Zips button, then select the next theme file. From here, hit Add More Zips, then add the next one, and so on. When you have them all queued up, swipe the slider and they'll be installed concurrently. Then when the process is finished, just tap Reboot System. When you get back up, you'll start to notice the changes immediately. System UI notifications in the status bar will be darkened for one, and then the dialer has a new look as well, provided you chose to install the theme, of course. Even the actual dial pad is themed. The app drawer isn't bright white anymore either. It's got a nice gray background to it. Even the settings menu is dark now, so let's see that. They kept with the gray and blue-green colors that were used in other stock menus, so it really looks like it belongs here. Overall, I'd say it's a really nice theme that'll save your eyes at night while not disrupting the material design style in Lollipop. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.